Guten Tag, insiders. I'm James, and I'm uh, happy to be back on the show. I'm here today to talk about one of my favorite YouTube programs with one of my favorite YouTube people. Pia, would you like to introduce yourself? Yes. Hi, my name is Pia. Thanks so much for having me, and I work on YouTube Next Up. Uh, and so is, first of all, like, tell people a little bit more about what you do at YouTube. Yeah, so I'm a partner manager. Uh, which means that I have the honor to work with YouTube creators on a day-to-day -day basis um, and help them grow their channels. And as part of my role, I also work on this wonderful program called YouTube Next Up, which helps to grow the next generation of YouTube talent. Yeah, and so Next Up, I think, is what we want to tell y'all a little bit about today. Um, I am a huge fan of Next Up because I've been able to go to a couple as a guest to learn from some of the creators and how they're using our tools. And just from watching it, I think this, this program is fantastic. And I think our audience will be super interested in it. So why don't you give us the like, I guess the pitch, what is, what is Next Up? Sure. So Next Up started in 2016, so not even that long ago. And it is really a creator boot camp, um, which is designed to showcase the next generation of uh, YouTube stars. And we're trying to do that through intensive content strategy and production training. So each of the programs has 12 winners, and they will receive a five-day crash course at a YouTube space. And they will receive courses on video production, content strategy development, and the goal is really to educate and inspire them to take their skills to the next level. Uh, they will collaborate with other winning creators and also they receive a voucher for brand new production kit um, to help them elevate their channels. That's incredible. So tell us a little bit more about the sessions. And so you said you mentioned production, but like, what do you actually do? Yeah, so we have um, usually a whole week lined up of uh, courses and events and uh, amazing workshops. We'll talk a little bit more about how we're shifting now the program uh, during the pandemic. Um, but usually we have a week packed full of content and production workshops. We hear from inspirational speakers, we, they join in exclusive events, they get one-on-one -on -one advice from top creators, next of alumni, and they also engage in uh, collaborations and projects with the other winners. One of the things I've thought I've enjoyed, you know, as an outsider there uh, and, and occasional speaker is seeing the way that all of the creators that have these amazing and different channels really become a community um, afterwards as well. That's right. Yeah, they do. Yeah, totally. And there's a support group aspect to it, I think, afterwards as well. You have, you know, I'm not a top creator or even a next up creator, but I, I can see how it can be a little lonely sometimes. You're doing a lot of work, maybe if you don't have a team by yourself. And then this is a, a group that understands what it is to be a YouTube creator. Give you can give you feedback. You can take ideas from them and apply them to your channel. I think it's really important to meet creators from maybe other verticals and other genres uh, that are not yours. I think you can learn and benefit so much from each other. And they usually really, really enjoy the next winners, really enjoy working together and collaborating. And it's such an amazing creative process that's happening in the camp. So yeah, it's definitely one of the big highlights. Um, Beyond the production stuff, what other uh, sessions do you do? Do you have any favorites or ones that you think people get a lot out of? Oh, there's so many. Um, for example, we do monetization workshops to really understand how you can monetize your content in the best way and use amazing products on YouTube um, that, yeah, make you earn money with your content. But then we also have things like storytelling classes, um, improvisation classes, uh, audio camera workshops, so much more there is just amazing things in there yeah and you actually bring in like i know the, the last one that, that i was in you brought in some brands who who came and said okay if you want to grow the kind of brand advertising part of your channel here's how to work with us and we're actually the people that would be you know writing some of these checks so it, it really does like help uh a creator that might be like you know i'm starting to have an audience but i don't know how to how you even have that conversation and gets you from you know, maybe, you know, zero to, to you know, if not 100, like at least 75, right? You kind of understand, understand what you're doing. Um, so in the past, we've had these in YouTube spaces together in maybe in London or New York. We went to one together in, in Berlin, but uh, people aren't traveling as much these days. How, what's the plan for this year? Yes, so at the moment, we're uh, trying to do them virtually. So we're trying to still get the best out of it and uh, make the most out of it. But yeah, at the moment, we're um, 
holding uh, virtual next steps. Yeah. And tell tell people a little bit. I, I I have a little bit of an inside view. Like, how are you adapting the schedule? Because I think this is really cool. Is it still like one week, like in front of the you know on a Google Meet for you know twelve hours a day, or you know how what's what's the what's, what's the wrinkle this year? Yeah, that's a really interesting question. So it's new to us as well. So we are experimenting with it um, and we're trying to spread it out over a couple of weeks. I think in India they did one with four months um, of a next up schedule. In Germany, we're going to try it now to do it over a course over the course of six weeks. Um, and we will have uh, several sessions a week over the course of a couple of weeks then. So yeah, we're trying to still have a packed agenda, have as much value as we can bring. So you've sold me. This sounds like an amazing program. What's the next, what, what next up is next up? What's the next one that's happening? So the next ones that are happening are actually gonna be um, YouTube next up camps in Germany and in Russia. So if you're from those uh, countries, please apply. <laughs> and are there any things in particular, like, I guess, is who is this open to? Who can apply for a YouTube Next Step? Yeah, so you have to have between 10 and 100,000 subscribers uh, to apply, and your channel must be in good standing. Applications are then assessed by an internal judging panel, and they're based on answers to several essay questions that you have to answer when you apply. And where can people go if they want to apply? So there is our wonderful Next Up page. So you can just go on the website of YouTube Next Up and you will see all the different uh, programs that are coming up and you can apply directly from there and we will leave a link in the description. Awesome. And so that's a good place to go too if, you know, if you're not a German creator or you're not a Russian creator, we do do these in other markets. It's, it's um, over time, right? It's just kind of depending on the team and, and uh, how much bandwidth they have. Is that correct? Absolutely. We're doing those globally. So absolutely stay tuned, have a look at the website. And uh, when the programs are open up for applying, then you can definitely just go for it. I love it. Um, anything else you want to let us know about the platform or want to share with the, uh, the Creator Insider audience? I think that's about it. I would just say really take the chance, be part of this amazing journey and uh, yeah, meet other creators and meet us. For us, it's also always amazing to see you guys grow and help you I grow your channels. So I would be super excited to see a couple of this lovely audience as soon as the next next up. All right, insiders, that's all we got this week. Uh, thanks for having us and we'll talk to you soon.